Jake Paul at Remax here. I'm at 65 Gravelly Hill Road in Cars. And just to give you a sense of the location, at the end of this driveway, and up to the end a little bit here, we're um, five minutes to the Evandale Ferry, or on the other side, five minutes to Hatfield Point. So, nicely located if you're up around the Belle Isle, in between Fredericton and St. John. Um, anyway, it's a beautiful, uh, beautiful two-bedroom home on a slab. Uh, on a little over 40 acres, and it's also got a really nice big Kwanzaa hut as well that's fully insulated and fully wired. Anyway, we're going to go into the house and I'll give you a quick tour. Hopefully it gives you a sense of the property. Going through the front door. It's uh, late February, about 2 in the afternoon. You see we get beautiful sun on the property here in the yard. Uh, some nice gardens here on the side. Uh, one of the things that's hard to get a sense of when you shoot a video this time of year is that it's really well-kept lawns, uh, lots of nice shrubs, lots of nice trees, just very nicely kept grounds. Coming in through the front door, we come into a really nice wide mudroom, ceramic tile floors. Got a laundry area over here, so the center of the house really has a nice utility area for sure. I'll quickly show you the garage here over on the right. Garage is um, almost 30 by 30, so it's a really nice big deep garage as well as a wide garage. Lots of space to park a car and work on whatever projects you have on the go. So from the mudroom when you come into the main living area, you've got a really, really nice, deep, dramatic um, open living space here. Nice hardwood floors. You can see... Uh, Wood burning stove, lots of room for firewood, uh, and really nice pine paneling throughout. Lots of nice big windows, lots of room for big furniture too. So this living room, not only deep and wide, but you know a lot of enough enough space for really nice big furniture. Going down to the end here, you see this room for a dining room table. They've got a smaller one here. The nice thing about this layout is there's so many different ways to set it up. If you wanted a nice big formal dining space, there's room for that. If you want a little less living room. But it's a really nice setup that way in terms of flexibility. Lots of cabinet space. Uh, off the kitchen there's a nice little pantry. So plenty of storage in here. And then over to the side here, the first bedroom. Lots of space in here, gets really nice light, uh, afternoon light. Nice deep closet over here. Dare say that's a walk-in closet. Then over to the side here, we've got full bath, ceramic tile floors, tub and shower kit. And then over at this end is the master bedroom. Nice big bedroom. You know, they've got it set up with a king size bed. You can see there's plenty of room for that. A little bit of office space there as well. Another uh, full bathroom, so uh, en suite with uh, full tub, uh, flush and vanity. And this one's got a walk-in closet as well. So you can see lots of storage in here. So really, really efficiently set up home for uh, single level living. Really nice and bright. Um, and you can see most of this part of the house really faces out towards the uh, backyard. And I'll show you that really quickly. So back here we've got a nice um, patio area that's got plenty of overhang so it's a really nice protected area so you're not out being beat by the sun all day long. You can just step out to the yard if you want to be in the sun but if you want to be in the shade you're perfect back here. But in the winter it obviously keeps the snow out as well so it's a really nice uh, clear open space. Nice uh, above ground pool with a little deck going right off the area. And you can get a sense here too it's a really nice flat yard with uh, plenty of space. And again, there's, there's 40 acres here. There's actually over 40 acres. So lots of room for your hobbies, whether that's ATVing, snowmobiling, just having some wood to play with, whatever. And you can see the garage has a back door here as well, coming to this back area. A little bit of a laundry stoop over there. And we'll pop back in. So that concludes the video tour for 65 Gravelly Hill Road in Cars. If you have any questions about this property, please feel free to give me a shout. I can be reached at 650-0092.
And my email address is jake at jakepalmer.ca.